Hey, my name is Mary Kay Worth, and this is entry number 36 of my original unpublished Family Legacy Library works that I was inspired to share. And I was inspired to begin the Africa book, which is a big one. It's like 12 inches by eight and a half. And this one is called, I Can Say I've Been to Africa. And I shared with you the front and the back covers. I'll do that again when I finish up. Um, but I also then read the first entry, and which was the poem, I can say I've been to Africa, definitely a Mary Kay poem. So for this one, I will be reading and sharing for you a couple of other pages and do the best to share them with you and remind you that they are anchored in my own journal entries out of sequence to go along with the pictures. Um, and it's just cool and good stuff. So, Indiglesi Street, Mababani, Swaziland. May 2nd, our flight across the Atlantic Ocean was uneventful. The Manzini Swaziland Airport said, Welcome to the Kingdom of Swaziland. This is the first country that I have been to that drives on the left side of the road. It feels very strange. My separate guest house is lovely, as is Martha and Lauren's gated home with a guard on duty 24 hours a day. The roads are narrow and full of potholes and bumps. Welcome to Africa, Mary Kay. Continent number five is amazing. Martha's Menagerie and Gardens are here, and Birds of Paradise welcome me in Swaziland at the home of my friend, Martha. Here is their home and the gate for 344 the door for my place and then a lot of Martha's Menagerie what you saw in the other books that I shared I'm gonna read one more page oh I see there's a giraffe paper mache giraffe it's cool old friends making new memories bushfire Mabalani Clarence, the Peace Corps, Yebo. Yeah, May 7th, imagine my surprise when several containers were the same student world dictionaries that I have been giving out in Rotary Clubs for 10 years to third grade students. Wow. It was an amazing experience. Lesotho is listed here too, and that's me and Martha and Lauren and all the stuff there. Boy, this book is big. But down here at the bottom, this picture right here, that's the picture of me working with the Peace Corps volunteers and discovering I was unpacking the same third grade dictionaries that I helped give out to many kids that were third graders and that's the peace corps group up there i had a great and this is we went out to lunch and one of the girls that i was there <laughs> she worked at the village market in wells college when i was superintendent so she actually waited on me isn't it amazing see how small the world is the world is small. Love it. Enjoy it. You have a great day.